guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes 9 and 10 of Bakai Managatari. But before we get started, I just want to talk about this <laughs> really, really quick. So, it's still Monday for me, and um, 7 and 8 came out today. A lot of people commented on certain things, especially with the fact that um, I talked about the fact that I wasn't going to watch the movies until I got to the second to last of the series uh, for it, and then I was going to watch the movie. And then watch the final series and then I'll be done with the series and it completely in its whole. Um, so I read people's comments. I looked up some things. I thought about it for like about 30 minutes to an hour trying to think of how if I should go one way or the other way. And I think how I'm going to do it. I will go ahead and watch the movies after this. I don't know if it's two or three movies. I don't specifically really remember how many movies it is. But... The biggest thing is I'm going to need is time. It's going to take me, I don't know how long each movie is. I'm guessing it's about maybe an hour and 30 minutes long, maybe two hours. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you this now so that um, when we get there, I ain't got to repeat it, but I may have to repeat it for people. I can only record up to an hour. I can't record over an hour like once an hour comes it just stops so I think how I'm going to do it is basically kind of how I'm doing it with this is when I get to a certain point in time so like let's say I go to the 55 minute arc of the first half of the movie and then start immediately right after so that people are not too too confused if there is a part for each one of the movies that I need to kind of stop on before something like good or bad happens let me know at least like a couple of weeks like it, it could be like from now until I start the movies because I, I need to know beforehand because if someone tells me kind of like maybe a week before I record the movies I'm out I'm not really gonna remember because I have so many things in my mind and I'm recording so many other stuff and then sometimes I may have to go back and look just in case but I didn't want this to be like other shows that I've done on the past on my previous channel um where I have watched a series and there's two routes and then I pick the correct route for it but then people will still technically get mad at me or they will get mad at the person who said, oh yeah, she really definitely needs to watch it like this. And everybody starts retaliating. Because like, I'm not saying that nobody did that as of now. Because from what the comments are saying, everyone's being really kind and courteous to everyone. And I didn't want to go into this to have people argue with me, argue with anyone else. I just wanted to have a nice, calm conversation. Because I, I would treat you the way you want to be treated. I don't need people to like go in the freaking comments put the caps lock on and literally like put big ass letters and uh, crap and just like they're yelling at me because I don't have time to have people yell at me. I don't want it. And it's and just that. So I'll watch the movies next. Um, since some people said there's some things about Shinobu that are going to be answered in the movies. Um, and then specifically for Hanekawa for, um, I think they said, someone said something about Nisei Managatari, Neko Managatari, and the second season. So, yeah. But just like I said, between now and until the, the last episode for uh, Bake, let me know um, a time point of where I can stop for each movie so then I can immediately continue because I don't want someone to be like, oh, well, now I don't know where the hell she is and stuff because of this. And so, but yeah, I'm not like... I'm still going to have the full movie on there, but it'll just be like, it'll be parted. Like, one part will be from this to this, and then one part will be from this to this. It'll just still be together. It'll just be very utterly weird. But other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode 9. In 3, 2, 1, go. I should have actually kind of got my but I'll do that after. Okay. Snake girl, right? Miss Sano. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hmm. 
Yeah, because she's got black hair, and in the opening, she has um, blue. Okay. Uh, <laughs> this is so weird now to just listen to this song for like the bizarre time. <laughs> I don't even know how many times played this song. <laughs> I literally took a nap. I know I was gonna take a nap, and he played it, and so I'm like this. And I start like singing it and my lips were moving and I was like, oh my God, I gotta stop singing the song. But I was like, it's so fucking cute and I love it. And then I woke up. <laughs> so I had a really short ass now, like 15 minutes because I kept replaying it over and over again. But yeah. It's just when I look at her and I just kind of remember some things the person kind of told me about, but not a lot. I don't know yet. But then the weirdest thing is, why did she have green hair in the opening and the brown, brown blackish hair in the episode? Is that the thing? Okay, so I saw tightly and then tie and curse. That's key words to snake right there. Mm-hmm. Ain't that funny how she got mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Snakes. And then you got pants on that has the word snakes on the butt pocket. Mm. Mm -hmm. I got a dog to do what? <laughs> Excuse me. Probably, but I, I feel like Ocean was lazy. And that's it. I mean, we can't do well. That is technically a favor. Of course. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Are you serious? Okay. Huh. See, to me, comedy is more, like, jock cute because, you know, she has a jock and she likes sporty things. I kind of ship them. But then at the same time, like, Endgame is Sinjohara and Agaragi and I like them together. Mm 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, good. Oh, that is if she still wants to play basketball. Are you okay? Do you want to sit on the stairs? She can sit on the stairs. Yeah, but you're sweating like. Cody, stop. Hey, you said you went six years ago. It's weird that I think Snake Girl is, like, maybe her ability is to kind of have people make her forget about her. Like, you know, in my... Did she mysteriously disappear? See, and she ain't nowhere to be fucking found. Something about this ain't right. This ain't no damn Blair Witch Project. Oh, there she is. Yeah. You sure you're okay? Alright, do you want to go home? What? What are we looking at? Um. Oh, it's snakes. Okay. Um. Nadeko, what the hell? Uh, um. Come here. 
fine. Stay over there. Come here! I've been calling you for like the past two minutes, dog. <sighs> Sit. And I'll let you go. I'll take you out after I'm done. Yeah, I want to. Yeah. Okay, good. Is that indicating she died? Cause something about that ain't right. Oh hell no. If this guy, okay, yeah, of course she was going to say yeah. Mm -hmm. And Nadoko is the snake guy, right? Right? She's so freaking curious, but then, uh, like, and mysterious, and that's what I like about her, but I, I just need answers on her. <sighs> you got 12 minutes, dog. You can do it. Yeah, most girls are like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, puppy, that hurts. God, move you now. Jesus. Just sit. Huh? 
Seriously? So then what are you gonna do? Where? Oh, so you're gonna backpack. Okay, that makes sense. But... But what about... Uh, yeah. Where are you going then? Now see, ain't it a little weird that she has a headache? Something about that ain't right. Mm -mm. Nope. Not a good one. It's always the cute ones. That's that a cult? Mm mm. She's doing some black magic, ain't she? She wants to, she ain't supposed to do. No, why are we going in there when it's technically getting dark? Mm -mm. Yeah. Possibly, we ain't. Y'all ain't gonna know until y'all get up there. Help. I kind of wish she called someone else, you know, have more backup. Oh, she, she about to kill it. So freaking cute. But then what happened? Yeah. Does she have a crush on him? I've seen that chair before. You sure? Is there a reason why? I'm recording.
Is she laughing? Why? What you about to do? Now, if she turned into a damn saint. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. What the hell is that? That no, that snake skin. No, uh, but it, exactly. Now you made her cry. Okay. Um. I got a weird feeling that when she kills a snake, maybe she, she get it on her body. I don't know. I'm so confused. <laughs> I, I mean, because it makes me wonder why is she killing snakes? There's got to be a big thing to it. And I'm guessing I'm not going to know until episode 10. I mean, I, I don't even remember how long this arc is. I think it's like four episodes long, I'm guessing. And I think the last arc is also four episodes long, I believe. I agree. I don't remember. I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know what to think about this. Like, what the fuck? What the hell is going on? This girl got sick. Get her. She got scared. Of what the? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Well, this show, I, I, I swear, like, honestly, this show puts, like, it, it doesn't put, um, Harihi or uh, Buddy Girl Senpai to shame, but I mean, they're all equally different and they're similar in certain ways. But uh, uh, I don't know. Cody don't even know what the hell I'm saying. <laughs> it's just weird that they, he goes back to the shrine. She's about to kill a damn snake. He stops her. They come back. She takes her clothes off and then she has scales on her body. Basically looking like skin. Like it's a part of her. Oh, what the hell? And he's bleeding again. Something really bad, like, I don't want to think the worst, the worst happens in Nautico, but, like, when I look at her, because she is so dang cute, I feel like one of the, 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 something really, really bad happened to her, and I don't, I have no clue, no fucking idea, I mean, I wish I could remember what the heck 
dude said to me about her months ago, but honestly, I can't because that was months ago. That was, like, I think at the beginning of the year. You think I'm going to remember anything from the beginning of the year? Especially if, like, someone sees the thing and just asks the question, yeah, like, you seen Monogatari? No. Oh, well, here's the thing to know about the girl who you're using in the intro. And then you just want to look at them like, well, well, thanks for telling me, even though at that time I didn't think I was going to be watching this show. And I didn't really want to know anything about her until I started watching it. But yeah, I just, I, I literally am stumped. And I feel like, I don't think she's, she was raped. She could have possibly gotten killed. But the thing is, because like, my thing, like the biggest thing I want to know, like, honey, um, honey, Kawa, she hasn't met her yet. So, and then the same thing as when he asked her, oh, hey, do you want to see my sister again? She said, no. Why is that? So, maybe when, like, as of right now, only Aragagi and What's-Her-Face can see her. So, what if the sisters came home and they can't see her? So, something, mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I ain't going to know until I watch episode 10, which would be probably in a couple minutes, because I gotta go see what she want. I gotta probably take him outside. And, yeah, I, ooh. Mm-mm. I, I'm like, yep, yeah, I'm just at a crossroads. I'm stumped. I don't know what the fuck. This damn show. Uh, oh my god. I love it, but y'all make me confused so damn much, and I fucking love the fact that I am confused as hell right now, but of course I'm gonna get my answers in the next freaking episode, so pause the video. I will see you guys in a couple of minutes or a second for episode 10, so bye for now. Okay, episode 10 and 3, 2, 1, go. Oh, okay. Oh. Okay, better cult. Mm -hmm. Don't fuck with that. Don't do no Ouija boards, nothing. Okay. And of course, girl got jealous and. which means the skin on her body. True. Um, okay, is she... She, I don't want to say she turned into a snake, but um, is she gonna turn into a snake? Because I, especially when she took her clothes off, I was like, I swear to God, if she turn, if they turn around, and this girl a fucking snake, <laughs> I'm just gonna be like, this is just normal. <laughs> but you know, I mean, maybe what if it's her hair? What if her hair turns into snake? She gonna be like Medusa up in this bitch? <laughs> it is worse because I'm making a face like I love this show. <laughs> I really do. <laughs> Yeah. 
Nandoko, I love you. But I'm, I'm kind of afraid of you right now. You got snakes, vampires. We're going to have like a damn... Uh, we're going to have a dog? A bee, maybe? A, like... If we have a bee, I swear to God. <laughs> oh, God. They're going to be a butterfly too? Okay. All right, then let's get it done. We need blood. I don't think so. But it's like with her. Okay, that makes sense. Have a CD with that. Mm. Okay. So are, are we going to see, you know, the gathering of people at this shrine in the movie? Well, let's hope so. But usually sometimes bad things do happen. Hmm? You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. There's something on my eye. How did I not just notice that? My God. So. Please be careful, even though I have a feeling something bad's gonna happen. Just please.
Because then he also makes me wonder, why didn't he call? Like, it, No, you know what? Let me say it like this. Every single time when there's a new girl, someone from the previous arc is, like, helping. I mean, she now helping with this situation. So, it, it, she, what's her face? She going to help in the next part with whoever's the last person, which is Hanekawa, right? Uh, maybe. You like Agaragi? Oh, God. Well, you know, um, that's nice to know. A.K.A. She, mm, she wanted him. Mm -hmm. I, I, I kind of figured that. But she being a little creepy about it. But that's you know, okay. I like creepy. You sure you ain't going to sweat? You ain't going to have no headaches or anything? Because just in case, you know, if we're going to go, we go. Or you go, let them stay. That's fine. Pretty good, maybe. Or like something that you think that is higher power. Um... It's a little too easy though. Um Yeah, but it still feels like it's too easy. I'll take him out to dinner or something. Take care of Shinobu for like a day. Mm hmm
I'm guessing that happened in the movie. Is she? Yeah, and I'm guessing she's starting to hurt. And I'm guessing he's not going to disappear until the very last, like, show of this series. Because I can't see him, like, leaving, like, halfway through the series until the end. Okay. Across. See, it was, it was because you didn't look at her. You didn't look at her. There, there, there's several. So then who else did? You? Ah, okay. Is, um... Even though I know he's gonna be okay, but still. <laughs> oh. 
Holy shit. Oh god. Um Oh, let me minutes. Do I have a, I got five minutes. But you're not going to be able to dodge it this time. I mean, dude. I, mm -hmm. Oh, God. But what's her face is going to come, right? Mm-hmm. I don't even think he has time to get excited. Okay. Cody, Jesus, what is wrong with you, dog? No, it's okay. Thank God she's okay. Okay, um, I think that's all I really have to say about this episode, it's okay. I mean, it was good. I, I just wasn't expecting that it was going to be two. I, like, uh, that whole entire time, I'm like, okay, it's just one. But then when she started, like, thrashing and everything, like, she was having a seizure in a way. I'm like, okay, Hunter, what if there is, like, multiple snakes? And to know that the guy that she rejected also started to hate her is really, like, upset, but upsetting, but... Uh, <sighs> That's fucked up, though. That's hella fucked up. That's all I can really say about that, but... I mean, he probably found somebody else. But I, I can get it, like, immediately hating someone because they reject you, or they're like, oh, hey, you called me a creep, when I clearly didn't call that person a creep. I'm sorry. Just need to get that out as well. Um, but, yeah! Hi, Cody. 
Jesus. Um, good episode. I almost cried. Almost. I think like once they when she was praying and she kept saying like I don't even look at me, look at me, and then he started thinking about something else, and then just by that he didn't look at her anymore. So, mm. but she's cute and I like her. She's not my best girl though. She's like a top five. Yeah, top five. But she's so cute. So is it still going to focus on her or? Not Machine Boo. Oh, well, hold up. Why is Sheena Boo make that face? <laughs> There you go. It's fucking right. See? Just sometimes you just get little guesses and then it's like, mm, see? I'm glad none of y'all told me with, like, the answer that I had from last week. Thank God. But just because I didn't want anyone to tell me. Because, like, sometimes when I say um, something and then no one, like, if someone really answers the question, I don't immediately want to know. I'm like, let me kind of find out on my own because I kind of really hate when people will say, oh yeah, at this part when you mention this, you are right on this. Spot on. Da -da 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 -da. Did you do something? You must know everything about it. You must have sat and like watched a video and quote unquote been spoiled. But I'm like, no, I'm like, it's just a fucking guess. Like, I, I just, you know, when you look at a character and you just have feelings about that character and you just like want to make a call on it and... Yeah, I don't even want to start on that drama. But it was a good episode. I'm just, you know, I thought her arc was going to be longer than just two episodes. So, Subasa Cat, I, I, that's, so hold on, it's 13 episodes. So then she's like, what, the final four episodes? 14 or 15? I don't remember. I got to look it up. But I, I think this is not, we're now getting into the over the other opening that I like a lot. Not the freaking mint one, because we're nowhere near there. That's, like, a long fucking time away. I think it's the, um... I th oh, my God. I think it's... Nakamanagatsu Black's opening or White's opening? I don't really remember, but I, I ain't gonna know until next week. But, like I said, it was a really good episode. I mean... There were some things I was expecting with it, and then there were others that I really wasn't. So, I mean, I'm glad that everything that happened in this episode happened. Uh, it's just, mm, I ain't got anything else. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction to be towards episodes 9 and 10 of Bake when I got today. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchless Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially next Friday for Patreons and next Monday for everybody else for episodes 11 and 12. Bye guys!